Hi guys, um, my name is Sam. I'm the program coordinator for the Office of Diversity and Inclusion. Um, I'm really excited because I'm gonna be introducing one of our own students, Stephen Hogan, um, before um, Nicole comes on. Um, Stephen is a senior goalie on the men's lacrosse team studying psychology and English literature. He was one of this year's orientation coordinators, the Student Athlete Advisory Committee's vice president, and helps lead the Spark Bible Study with Campus Ministry. The first time hearing about Stephen and his poetry, I was in Bible study with him. Um, I was moved by his poetry, and I was more than happy to give this recommendation to Dr. J. So please welcome Stephen. Hey, guys. Uh, so these are two of my poems. Uh, the first one is called Haunted. The night slowly fades to black. Silence falls over the whole city. Every eye closes and the dreams start to run wild. Laughter and happiness. Beautiful sceneries, slow dancing to our song. My arm wrapped around her shoulder, holding her tight. I refuse to let her go. She brightens my day. She is my world, my sunshine. The night is still young, but the sky is dark as ever. The shadows loom, memories fade, sceneries burn, the dancing turns jagged. Our song only brings me tears. My heart is racing, and I feel you slip out of my arm. My, ours, my eyes dart open, and I emerge from bed. The night is still young. My dreams are still fresh. Thousands of people sleep in peace, knowing the ones they love are beside them. But here I sit, unable to escape from you, having no one to run, from, having no one to, run to cover or protection. You are buried in my mind, and you won't leave me be. The ghost of you refuses to let go, leaving me haunted. Right, and then uh, this one is called, To the One That's Always There For Me. There's just something about you I can't put my finger on it. I don't know why, but I can't get you out of my head. I don't know how you managed to do it. Maybe it was your eyes, maybe it was your glow. That glow that makes you stand out from the rest. It definitely could have been that you laughed at my jokes even when no one else did. Or maybe it's that you just gave me a chance. A chance to be the real me. You got to see the side that no one else does. You listened when I felt like being silent, and you were scared on days you didn't hear from me. So maybe I'm just overthinking things like I normally do. Because looking at it now, I can say exactly what it is about you. You did something that isn't always easy. You cared. Thank you.